I'm going down to South Park, gonna have myself a time. Friendly faces everywhere, humble folks without temptation. Going down to South Park, gonna leave my woes behind. If we're parking day or night, be with bad and hot and dry. And on up to South Park, gonna see if I can't unwind. Three, two, one, go! What did you say? I'm sorry. 
story takes place at the Stodges' house. Butters had just gone grounded for eternity for threatening to beat up Carl Belfosky. Of course, Butters, deeply upset at this fact, decided to go to bed early so that he could forget about it the next morning. That night, Butters had been experiencing some night terrors and had no idea why. He didn't know what they meant. He thought maybe they were trying to tell him a message, but was still deeply confused at why he kept having these night terrors. So he went to go get a glass of water to calm him down. And just then, he heard a noise in his closet. He decided to go investigate. Butters didn't think there was going to be anything worth finding in there, but he decided to turn on the light just to be sure. Just then, a demonized version of Carl Borflowski popped out of Butters' closet and started dancing on him. Butters, completely terrified and somewhat confused, had no idea what was going on. Butters had no idea what the hell was going on. But he decided to forget about it and go back to sleep. But the thought of the demon seeped into his mind and was having trouble trying to forget about it. It was at that moment that he realized that the demon of Kyle Rafalski had full control over him and couldn't find a way out. Three, two, one, go!
I'm going down to South Park, I'm gonna have myself a time. Oh, <laughs> 